This course has a work-related focus. In each of the modules, students look at a cluster of related occupational areas. They learn to carry out techniques and standard procedures that are used in these workplaces. They learn some applied science that's relevant. They also go on to solve problems, carrying out suitability tests to see what might work best, what procedure or what technique or what material might work best in a particular situation. They also learn about the framework within which this work is done. The major employers, the regulators, the values and, the, um, and other factors affecting the, the nature of the work. There are six modules and schools are free to choose any three from those six. There's no right answer to which three. There doesn't need to be, for example, a balance between biology, physics and chemistry. It was quite good to have the freedom to choose which the three would be. And for some teachers, they're very clear that they wanted to teach their specialism. And there is a particular group we've got at the school now where the teacher wants to uh, allow pupils to go on to A-level chemistry because he feels with the particular modules he's choosing they will have enough skills and knowledge to do that. Um, for the other teachers it is perhaps allowing them to have subjects that they can really put a lot of personal input into so that they're happy with it. Um, and again choosing which modules will be best for certain pupils. As well as the written test for each module students prepare a work-related portfolio. That includes some standard procedures which they've carried out, a suitability test where they've looked at what's best for a particular job, and a work-related report. The suitability test might, for example, look at thermometers, the kind of thermometer that's best for use in a hospital ward of course would be very different than the kind of thermometer that you might use if you were in a factory making yogurt. Uh, and so it's important that the thermometer is fit for purpose. Students understand what the purpose is and then test the thermometer against the criteria needed for that job. With the work-related report, they have the opportunity to find out more about a particular practitioner, uh, the context in which they work and the science that they use. They get to find out about the qualifications necessary for that job and the particular qualities that the person has who's able to do the job successfully. Applied science has been a real success. I mean, it's just our first term of teaching it and already um, we just say to ourselves on a constant basis, my gosh, if we compare this to teaching the blast furnace last year or teaching uh, kids to draw posters of electron shells and, and what are they getting out of this? Whereas today all our applied science students went down and had a talk from the school nurse which went really, really well and um, as part of their work-related learning. By doing the applied course, it will help a lot. With, with, with pupils who are not academically inclined and wanted to do a trade-based um, activity outside, within the outside world. So they will fit quite neatly within that radius. So I, I think it is fantastic.